All right, so one of these jobs pays $69 an hour. That's $2,829 a week. Yeah, for 41 hours. That's working from home. Who thought? $2,829. Also, I've got one $24.80 an hour that starts with no experience. $1,1680. $1,000 a week for 41 hours. 10 different spots we're going to talk about here, which is pretty cool. I always say give a way for people to go. Give somebody an opportunity, not a handout, but a hand up. Have you ever been in the situation where you've been without a job and don't have the skills or experience or education to get one? There is a place you can go. Whether you need money, you're changing careers or returning for a job after maybe being a caretaker during some tough times or maybe you were in the military and your job that you trained for doesn't relate to anything in society. Well, you're not alone no matter what your circumstance. The good news is that there are ways to earn extra money without having a lot of expertise. And this is fantastic news and with the internet, and with the sites that I'm gonna tell you about, you can get connected quickly. This is just unbelievable. It's like, you know, the tender of jobs. It's absolutely amazing. There are actually a lot of entry-level occupations that you can perform from the convenience of your home, thanks to the virus, I guess, and working from the house. You have a lot of different choices now. A lot of companies have now built on being able to hold people accountable from their home and be able to give you an opportunity. Even while you might not be wanting to do this the rest of your life, and that's the thing, you don't have to do this stuff for the rest of your life. It may not be the ideal position for you long-term, but it's something you can do to make ends meet while you're trying to make a decision on the next thing you're going to do. So I think maybe stick around. There might be some interesting because <laughs> I found some a difference of all kinds of different positions that you can do. Some of them just are walking. Like if you can walk, you can get paid. Some of them are just talking. If you can talk, you can get paid. And if you like to persuade people, well, that's there too. In this video, I'm going to explore some of the top work from home career possibilities for entry level positions because that's what you'd want to know, right? The top ones. I'll go through the benefits and I'll also the drawbacks of each position as well as offer some advice on how to find your first work from home position so that you can stay and get ready to earn some money and discover new prospects. So let's talk about that in this video so that we can get up to speed. Hey guys, my name is Andrew Cartwright and I'm here to help you get money, which is what this is about. Leverage it, which is all about loans and also how to invest it into your future so you can have long lasting, stable success. I've been broke and homeless four different times. Yep, four different recessions, rodeos, all kinds of stuff and just bad partners and bad situations. But this last time, I believe I've locked it in and invested properly. So since then, I've created 32 companies over 40 years in 17 different industries. Yes, I was born in the 1900s. I'd run as many as 15 companies at a time. But now I'm looking to partner with you in Epic 99 to buy 99 companies. 81% will be owned by you and 19% will be owned by me and my partners in the equity firm. Right now, it's just me. But eventually, I hope to grow this to have more people involved in it. There's a link down below if you're interested in that. Also, if you want a business loan, if you're looking for a business loan, I got 12 different programs, 80 lenders or 81, sometimes 75. They run out of money and they get more money back in. So make sure you check it out in the link down below. As well as if you want free stock, check out Moomoo and Weeble down below in the link. Fund your account with a penny and get some stuff. Both employees and businesses like it better when people work from home. Well, at least some businesses anyway, like the idea of remote work. They don't have to have as much off office space and that's okay and now there are possibilities for people to earn money from the convenience of their home just kicking back being close to the refrigerator and that's why we're talking about that in this video you may have to go to the library to earn some of this money if you're using don't have a computer maybe you're watching this on an iPhone I don't know let's go through the top 10 list of remote employment opportunities first one is virtual helper just virtual helper let's talk about the first goal which is to fill the post of viral assistant as the job title suggests the main response responsibility is a position to help clients with administrative and executive tasks from a distance. Now you might be an attorney and you're like $350 an hour and you need to buy back your time, scheduling calls, calendars, all that stuff. You'll be responsible for a wide range of virtual assistants, such as managing those emails. If you can open an email, you can plan some travel. Maybe you've done that or schedule a meeting on a calendar. That's what you need to know. So you probably already have those skills and you probably need some good communication skills, organizations, and skills to keep track of stuff to be professional. The company that you would go to online is Belay, B-E-L-A-Y, Time, etc., and Upwork. There are opportunities that range for these
these virtual assistants of $24.80 an hour. This is pretty cool. The next is customer service representative. If you like taking care of customers and listening to people, feeling for their problems, this is probably for you. Incoming calls, emails, chats, clients, and all kinds of stuff. Maybe you're good at listening to people complain. This could be the perfect job from you to work from home and it could be the perfect outsourcing position because call centers are basically sending out people all the time to help with this situation. I've heard chickens in the background now. I've heard cows in the background on these virtual assistants that are helping and you can get $17.75 an hour for that type of job, which I think is um, pretty incredible. The next one, the highest paying job is bookkeeping. This is the third and a common misconception is that you can't do bookkeeping without having some kind of bookkeeping experience and you don't need to have much, just basic math skills, computer skills, and a strong desire to help business owners because most of them in the real world, they want nothing to do with their bookkeeping. The place to go is bookkeepers.com. And it's the go-to site if you're interested in bookkeeping because it offers one of the most comprehensive education programs accessible. Yep, right now you can watch a video, learn in a week, and have a job. If you're successful, you can make $69 an hour. This, I think, is incredible. Sales rep would be another one. Let's say you're just persuasive. You like talking somebody into something. You like giving advice. You like helping people. I went once went to a camera store. They literally everything I wanted to buy I wanted to buy a lighting kit they talked me out of buying anything because I couldn't make up my mind because they said well it depends on preference that sort of thing there was not one single salesperson in the store not one person wanted to talk me into what would make sense or what they believed in so if you're confident persuasive you should think about being a sales role forget the word sales think about it as someone who likes to coach people like I just love helping people right helping people help themselves that's my like favorite role in life is to help people get get ahead. So if you're good on the phones, you like assisting people, typically the base salary for this is $47,000. But if you get good at sales, the sky's the limit. I know people that make millions a year in sales. Now transcription, the fifth position is transcribing. Yes, even though we've got transcribing things that'll work for podcasts, talks, interviews, all kinds of stuff, they still need people to help correct some of this stuff as well. There are many companies on a regular basis you can check out for REV, Upwork, and Scribe. That's S-C-R-I-B-I typically about $20 the next an hour for that one tutoring the sixth position on the list is tutor if you have any experience you like working with kids and like teaching lessons the lesson plans are already created for the tutors and you can help students of all ages that are assigned work preparation or test preparation it's called care.com is the place to go fantastic site that you can look at $20 an hour for that now registration clerk the seventh position on the list is data entry clerk now if you can enter data into a computer from documents and that sort of thing this may be what you want to do some people may find this boring some people may find this really just kind of easy and they can think about other things you must though pay strict attention to detail be pretty well organized and be able to put it in there uh, zip recruiters one that offers this job flex jobs and penny hoarders work from home portal they pay $17.13 an hour on average and if you like to act or like thinking about things you could be a mock juror a mock juror is a person who offers criticism to attorneys like you you know if you always wanted to talk back to an attorney you can tell them I think you're wrong you sucked you have vulnerabilities your case has holes in it. Yeah, if you like thinking about that kind of stuff, you like law and like the figure out what it's like to be in a mock jury and play the game of a juror inside a courtroom, you can go online. There's online verdict and e-jury. Who would have thought? These are like new jobs that who would have thought are just available online. You can get 10 to five to $10 per case to get in touch with uh, those different sites and give them some feedback. And if you love walking and you love animals, you might want to think about being a pet sitter. Yeah, walking dog is another one uh, that hits the list of high things to do. It's probably personal gratifying, kind of clear your air. And if you're transitioning between jobs, it might be a great way to think about the things that you want to do in life while you're walking good old Rover. That might be something that feels good to your heart and soul. Pet sitting gigs are, I love dogs, but Rover and Wag is one of them and they typically pay 10 to $20 a walk. I don't know how long it takes, how long the walks are, but if you like long walks in the park, uh, that sounds like a dating site. Mystery phone shopper. If you love shopping, you can get paid to shop. It's right up your alley if you love that. You provide customer service feedback to companies by shopping for them. You go give your experience, whether you were satisfied, what happened in your experience. The task is completely on your own schedule and flexible. Sinclair Customer Matrix and also Market Force are the best places for mystery shoppers. Now they pay $21 an hour to go shopping. Want to go shopping and make $21 an hour? I think some people would want to. And if you love talking about brands, you could be a brand spokesman. Working in a professional includes interconnecting 
using online sites with visitors, giving advice and recommendations, fostering customer satisfaction, written reviews that are needed and responses to inquiries. Companies routinely post available ambassador positions to help with them because they need people to help them. So it's another one that you can go to. Uh, you can get merchandise and cash. Also wages pay $20 and 14 cents. Also search engine evaluator, believe it or not, they still need help in search engines to help them be reliable and accurate and give the right answers. So they're posting that. ChatGPT is another one that's going to be probably paying a lot of people. They got $10 million, $2 billion in the bank to help people say whether something's good or bad. Those positions will pay $47,829. Again, who thought that was a job? We've got search engine. We've got dog walker. We got mock play like you're a jury, mystery shopper, all kinds of stuff that, that you can do. Evaluating companies, if you like being critical on that stuff, there's just all types of stuff that you can do that might my best suggestion would be do something that matches your interest and also works with your schedule and allows you to earn some extra money while you're thinking about what you want to do long term you might just find something that really feels good to you and you may stay there long term who knows especially at $69 an hour. Maybe you like typing in numbers and figuring stuff because I'm telling you, businesses hate dealing with their books. Mandrew Cartwright, I love you.